vote. Do you have anything for us this morning? Uh, just to, uh, two items, uh, Commissioner. Thank you. Uh, number one, to note that uh, uh, this past week I went to the Washington County's risk pool uh, summer meeting uh, and um, looked at uh, their efforts to secure continuing coverage for the 09 2010 uh, insurance year and um, which was successful. However, uh, our premiums will be going up roughly 29%. Whoa. And it's likely that for the 2010-11 year that they may go up another 30% that year. It's not known yet, but um, I guess um, uh, the last couple of years, even though the insurers had full information from the pool about claims and exposures uh, that really they were under collecting on uh, premiums to cover their payouts. So now they're playing catch up. Um, my speculation is it's probably, it may well be tied to the fact that uh, insurance companies are not getting the investment income that they used to, yeah. which in the past have helped subsidize <coughs> or buy down so right, that's historically the way insurance companies make their money. If you want to borrow like twenty million dollars, who do you go to? You go to somebody that has it, and that's why it would be somebody like an insurance company to invest. But you know, they took the hit that everybody else took uh, last year, so the other source is premiums. Yeah. So, um, and there are a number of other items that we'll be following up from uh, from those meetings. Yeah. Yeah. With, with that big of a bump, uh, uh, I think there is a competing agency. Um, yeah, the rural uh, counties pool, and uh, Lauren and I were just speaking about that this morning. And um, while, as a founding member of the Washington County's risk pool, it would take a lot for us to move. Uh, it's always good to check out what else might be available. So we'll be getting a quote there. Um, anticipating that they're probably facing many of the same kinds of market pressures as well. Yeah. Would think so. Yeah. Wondered if those two shouldn't really be combined, but I guess that's... I don't, don't think we're ready to be self-insured. Yeah. No. no. This is a good thing for me. Yeah. One of the, one of the issues I think that we'll probably go do some analysis of is currently the county's deductible is $10,000. Um, the next um, higher deductible is $25,000, and it would be, uh, I think it would be prudent for us to do, with the help of the pool, do some analysis of uh, our claims history and, and look at the difference between payout and, and uh, on losses and, and premiums uh, if we were to go with that, to the higher deductible. What is the decision making point for this? It's coming up. Uh, I believe the um, the date for making that decision would be the end of this month. Oh, yeah. It goes year to year, calendar year. It goes from uh, I think October first. October first. Yeah. Okay, so it's like the federal. <laughs> So that was probably the most significant takeaway I took from that. Uh, also, just the pool continues to pursue um, the trainings and tools to help reduce the count collectively our, our various counties' uh, ex uh, loss exposure. So you know, through training, you can lower risk. So we're, uh, we'll be following up on some of that as well.